History in the making. That is the sentiment many get as they watch the Ithaca Bombers offensive attack in action this season. And the show that the Bombers put on against the Rochester Yellow Jackets on Saturday afternoon may have been their most impressive showing to date. In a 59-0 route over the Yellow Jackets, Bombers head coach Dan Swanstrom credited the offensive explosion to his team's ability to stay focused on the next play. Well, right now they're 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 really bought into what we're trying to teach. You know, they're really not letting the play before beat them, and they keep playing. They come back and they try to execute to the best of their ability, um, and, and that's something that we've been working really hard on for the past three years here. And uh, you know, they're able to pull themselves out and refocus on the next play at hand. Leading the Ithaca scoring brigade was All-American quarterback Joe Germanario, who thinks that hard work and preparation has been the key for this group's success. This doesn't happen overnight. Um, every, guy single, every single guy's preparation starts with the O-line. They did a great job protecting today, and our skill guys just made plays. You saw Mikey, Vito, you know, they, they doubled Will quite a bit, and mm -hmm. our other guys had to get going, which, you know, they responded in a big way. Really, though, how special is this Ithaca Bombers offensive unit? Well, special enough that they are on pace to score more than the 1974 team who holds the record for scoring average. Through seven games, this group is averaging just over 47 points per game, roughly three points per game ahead of the 1974 squad, who averaged 43.8. Despite being on pace to put themselves in the record books, it is not something that these bombers are paying attention to. We don't care about that. We're, we're worried about going one and zero, and you know we have a huge opponent in Union next week, so that's what we're worried about. We don't care how much we score. We just want to win each game. With the scoring record within reach, and now only being the seventh team in school history to start at seven and zero or better, these bombers will continue to etch their name in the history books. It seems like. Reporting for the Gridiron Report from the University of Rochester, I'm Alex Hessig.